Weinstein is disputing claims directors Terry Zwei and Peter Jackson made about him launching a smear campaign against Mira Sorvino and Ashley Judd. Zwei took to accusing Weinstein of preventing him from hiring Sorvino for Bad Santa and apologized to the actress his claim comes after Jackson first accused Weinstein of blacklisting Sorvino and Judd and creating a smear campaign against them. On Saturday night, Weinstein denied both claims by Jackson and Zwei via his spokesperson to DailyMail.com, Mira Sorvino was spotted running errands in Malibu on Monday. The 50-year-old actress has been a topic of heated conversation amid the ongoing Hollywood sexual assault scandals. The mighty Aphrodite actress was seen shopping at a local supermarket in the trendy beachside community. Harvey Weinstein is disputing claims that directors Terry Zwei and Peter Jackson made about him launching a smear campaign against actresses Sorvino and Ashley Judd because they fought back when he sexually harassed them. On Saturday night, Zwei tweeted that he had wanted to hire Sorvino for Bad Senna but claimed that he was stopped by Weinstein from doing so and apologized to the actress. I was interested in casting Mira Sorvino in Bad Santa, but every time I mentioned her over the phone, to the Weinsteins, I'd hear a click, Zwei wrote. What type of person just hangs up on you like that? I guess we all know what type of person now. I'm really sorry Mira. Zwei's claim comes after Jackson, who directed The Lord of the Rings, first accused Weinstein of blacklisting Judd and Sorvino in Hollywood. Jackson alleged that Weinstein and his brother are second-rate mafia bullies who talked him out of casting Sorvino and Judd in The Lord of the Rings series in the late 1990s. Judd and Sorvino are among the dozens of women who have accused Weinstein of sexual misconduct. I recall Miramax telling us they were a nightmare to work with and we should avoid them at all costs. This was probably in 1998, Jackson said. At the time, we had no reason to question what these guys were telling us, but in hindsight, I realize that this was very likely the Miramax smear campaign in full swing. Sorvino said on that she burst out crying after reading Jackson's revelation. There it is, confirmation, that Harvey Weinstein derailed my career, something I suspected but was unsure, she tweeted. Thank, you Peter Jackson for being honest. I'm just heartsick. But in a statement from a spokesperson to DailyMail.com, Weinstein refuted both claims by Jackson and Zwei. The statement reads, as Peter Jackson explained in his own statement, Bob and Harvey Weinstein had nothing to do with Lord of the Rings. If Ashley Judd said she was in conversations with Mr. Jackson and reviewed sketches, it was under new line, which had casting authority, not Miramax. Miramax never provided sketches to anyone. Around the time of Rings, Mr. Weinstein cast Ms. Judd and Frida and years later, in Crossing Over. Miramax had flown Ashley to New York for casting discussions and to meet the production team for good, while hunting. While Ashley was the top choice for Miramax and Mr. Weinstein, the role went to Minnie Driver, who was the star and director's preference. 
Minnie did a brilliant job and he believes Ashley would have, as well. Mr. Weinstein did not blacklist Mira Sorvino, and was in fact working with her during the time frame, in question on Mimic, the Guillermo del Toro film. Also during that time, she was dating Quentin Tarantino, who was the foundation and backbone of Miramax. At the time in question, no one could have blacklisted or derailed the career of Ms. Sorvino, who had recently won both an Academy and a Golden Globe Award and was being courted for leading roles by all seven studios and every major broadcast network. After the success of Lord of the Rings, Peter Jackson was so powerful he could have cast anyone he wanted in The Hobbit. Neither Ms. Judd nor Ms. Sorvino had roles in the film. Mr. Weinstein continues to admire Mr. Jackson for his creative genius, but he firmly denies these accusations. Mr. Weinstein denies speaking with Terry regarding casting. That was a Dimension film and Harvey had nothing to do with it. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment your opinion, share this video and subscribe to my channel. New videos are uploaded every day.